I love being outside. That's normally why I do most of my videos outside. For years, I mean, literally, we're talking like possibly five years or so. I've been talking about a heartbreak and inspiration and resolutions and deep thoughts and nature and pretty stuff and tragedy. A tree fell on my pool the other day. <laughs> <laughs> I got two summers out of that thing and a tree fell on it. We're in the middle of cutting that up. Things get bunched up and you can have what some people call hope. You can have what some people call prayers. You can have what some people call faith. I see people online. There's enough about, enough talk about hope and prayers. It's time for some action. That's what nobody realizes is, yeah, you can pray all you want, but if you don't prepare for the rain, when it does rain, all it does is erode your soil. So try that one on for size naysayers you, you gotta prepare for the rain and there's plenty of verses in the book that none of you want to read over the last year I went through something that I finally I went through the desert far enough that I uh, I didn't decide I was forced to do nothing but pair, prepare for the rain. And I realized I was far enough in the desert that there, there was nothing going to gather the water. So, for the most part, I started preparing for the rain. Here within the last couple of weeks, a beautiful sprinkling of exactly what I was praying for or some of what you would say I manifested came towards me and I got out my collectibles and my uh, buckets and my irrigation systems all within myself and I did my best to gather that rain. And boy, I'm praying that I never go thirsty again off of the water that was given to me within it. I'm speaking of metaphors as I do, so hang with me on this one. But it tastes very sweet. And it washes over me in a very cleansing way. And I'm a lot happier than I even imagined I would be at a moment like that. And I pray for good things. And the reason I'm speaking of metaphors is because I uh, care not to completely reveal what it is that I'm speaking of. Because it's mine right now. But it's good. It's very good. So, as that is happening, in a long time, I stopped to smell these little guys. And I quit worrying about dumb shit like that because 
That's always going to happen. <laughs> Prepare for the rain. How about a tree fall on your pool? <laughs> so, we're obviously talking metaphor here. Because <laughs> my basin's done been popped. I have had someone come into my life that makes it more special than what I was asking for to begin with. And I relish and I bask and I do my best to have no fear within it. Not a fear of loss of tomorrow, just a rejoice in what is here today. Because everything goes away eventually even me and probably my words but what time is it it's now where am I I'm here. Who am I? This moment. And this moment's good. Shaka.